Motions and demotions inside the Spokane Police Department. Spokane's mayor is keeping his campaign pledge to make sweeping changes within the Spokane Police Department. Today, City Hall announced the reorganization of the police force, including the demotion of Assistant Chief Scott Stevens to a captain's position in charge of improving training techniques. In the meantime, Major Craig Meidel, he takes over the Assistant Chief spot at the beginning of the new year. KXY 4's Jeff Humphrey live at City Hall tonight. He's in the heart of Spokane, actually, where they expect to put a lot more police officers on the street, right? Yeah, Mike, the number of officers assigned to patrol here in downtown Spokane jumping from two to seven. They are called neighborhood conditions officers, as in they'll be looking for whoever is making downtown unsafe or unsavory and hopefully getting rid of them. The new police chief says he plans to do the same thing in the neighborhood where you are living. Faithfully perform and discharge the duties of chief of police for the city of Spokane. After taking a year to hire a new chief after giving Frank Straub three months to test drive his police force, today Spokane's mayor was finally in position to pull the trigger on his plans to overhaul the department. Fundamentally, that has to do with the safety of your city and how uh, your citizens feel in their city and that they need to feel safe, that they should be expected to feel safe. And how do we do that? Under the reorganization plan, the officers who patrol the city and the detectives who investigate cases will be working for the same guy, Commander Brad Arleth. Together, the two outfits will fight crime literally from block to block and house to house. Where are those really hot spots of crime? Who are the people that are driving the crime problem in this neighborhood right here? What are they doing? Who are their associates? Go after them with laser-like focus get rid of them. Citing a 14% increase in property crimes over the past two years, Straub also plans to target the buyers of your stolen valuables. Because those people that are buying stolen property in this city, we're going to take you out of commission. We're going to put you out of business. Because if people that are stealing property have no place to sell it, there's going to be less of a reason to steal the property. That means using new techniques like this sting operation that shut down the fence allegedly working out of this nail salon, but Chief Straub thinks his approach to fighting crime can make a difference. And what we're looking for is not crime down by one or two percent. What we really want to see is crime going down. So instead of going up next year, what you're going to see is crime taking a significant decrease. Now, this reorganization has divided up the city of Spokane into eight districts, and in the near future, the police department plans on issuing weekly reports about crime in your neighborhood so you can keep an eye on trends. It's a report card of sorts that you're going to want to see because perhaps this summer, maybe in August, the mayor may be asking taxpayers to hand over more money to fund public safety. Reporting live downtown, Jeff Humphrey, KXOI 4.